Welcome to Church Online. Hope you've had a great week. Today is all about our mums. I love my mum because she's really nice, she's always there for me, and she makes really good pizza. Today we honour mums past and present. We honour our grandmas and nanas who share a special kind of love with us, as well as lots of lollies. We also honour our sisters who sometimes think that they're our mums. And we also honour our aunts, teachers and friends who sometimes feel mothering duties. We love all these mums and today we want to show them how much they mean to us. So whether you're a mum or you just have a mum, hope you enjoyed today's service. Have a good week. A tribute to my mother, Grace Madeline Epps. His favourite hymn was, I Come to the Garden Alone. Your firm, gentle guidance, your strong faith, leading your husband and us five children into the Adventist church. This has immeasurably influenced all I have done, all that I do, and all I will ever do. Your strong spirit, born the eldest of 13 children, surviving the Great Depression, your marriage of 72 years, has indelibly imprinted on all that I have been, all that I am, and all I will ever be. You are a part of all your children have accomplished, your love of study, gardening, baking and sewing with beautiful materials, especially lace, are a part of all your children have accomplished and all we have become. For you, our dear mother, we learned, with God we are never alone. A mother who admonished us from God's side never to depart. A loving mother who taught us how to face the great unknown. Today we honour your memory from the bottom of our hearts. Until we meet again. Silas, why do you love mummy? To win. I love you in the whole world. Because I love you in, in the... So I love you Sunday, I love you Wednesday, and I love you Friday. And I love you Tuesday and I love you Friday. What do you love doing with mummy? Um, playing with you. What's your favourite activity we do together? Um, build a city and play. Mm -mm. That's mine. Right? Do you, Silas, what's your favourite thing to do with Grammy? Um, I make cupcakes with her. That's fun. And what's your favourite thing to do with Nana? Um, Nana bread with Nana. Wow, you love to cook, don't you? <laughs> That's awesome, buddy. Anything you want to say? Um, um, maybe I should come to Grammy's house on, on Sunday. Glenn Mattingly, in memory of my mum. You were the most truly wonderful mum, a treasure that can never be replaced. You nurtured me with your tender love and supported me in every way. One in a million, I will never forget the precious times we shared. Memories of you I will always cherish, knowing how deeply you cared. Your spirit will live on forever in my heart and in my mind.
A Prayer for Mother's Day by Claire Schoep. Lord, we remember the mothers who have gone before us. For their love, sacrifice, struggle and joy, we thank you. Lord, we remember the mothers of scripture who are a part of our story as we are a part of your story. For their courage, faith, love and fierceness, we thank you. Lord, we remember those who have not given birth to us, but are mothers to us. For their gift of themselves that they have given, we thank you. For the women who struggle with fertility, for those women whose society labels as less in their childlessness, for those women who have lost children, for their tears, for their strength, for their wisdom, for their lives, we thank you. In your name we pray. Amen.